All right, hello YouTube. Um, it's been a few. Uh, had a party yesterday and whatnot, and had my nephew ride in the car with me. Like you seen the title of the video. Um, I'll get to that later on. Um, I'll post the video up of that. I'm going now, heading over to Chums. Um, we're gonna put his door on his passenger door and his fender because. Um, on his pinto because he got a dent on it he wants to start sanding it down for creatures of the night which is a car show that's coming up pretty soon in June or July I believe I have to look that up but I'm definitely trying to make it out there if I still have the hatch and he's trying to take two of his cars and everybody's going to be going at that alright so I pull up here he got the door off putting the other one on Got the fanner hanging. I gotta try to figure out how to get this bolt off because it's stripped for the bottom of the front of the fender here. But yeah, this is the plan for the day. <laughs> I mean, the door is already on. We just gotta adjust it. That's it. And then just try to get the other fender on then. All right, since I'm not gonna use this, the flex dip, we're just gonna basically just do, cause the door was white and the fender was blue. I already got the fender, which is over there. And um, I'm just gonna do the door black, um, just the regular flat black, so that it could somewhat stay matching the car, so it don't look completely off. So, I mean, you don't wanna have a white fender or white door and a blue fender, so it's definitely noticeable. So <laughs> let me do this door real quick. Got it all back together, windows all in there and everything. Um, he was doing the door while I was doing the fender and stuff. Um, got the corner light and everything back on, so. I mean, it's looking a lot, it looks a lot more decent because this fender, I mean, this fender wasn't this bad, right? It was when you bent it. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't this bad. So, like you can see. They're like, he kicked it. He must have got mad. Get this off the way. The rust all right there. Which he didn't want to have to deal with. So. Oh, my foot got stuck. <laughs> Done. Um, like I said, I just basically just dipped the door and the, and the fender. Because the door was white. See, door was white. All I did was from this rail all the way down, and then you can see the fender was blue, like this blue, like teal, whatever color. So, but yeah, definitely looks a lot cleaner now. It looks better. Right there, the white EG. It's the forgotten one. Next up is we're just hooking up some fog lights, real quick. So the Pinto, this is the Pinto. This is what we call the Pinto. Well, Chum calls the Pinto. Why you call it the Pinto, Chum? Because it's ugly. <laughs> it is not ugly. It is a nice car, man. From what it, it from where you started at, from stock. He ended up ordering the corner lights, got some wheels, put some coils on it. Other than that, I mean, it's a very healthy car. It runs good. <laughs> it runs great, actually, because he drove it to Philly and back with no issues, so it's a good car. All right, so we got the fog lights on. It looks really good. I'm liking it. Like I said, it's just those simple little things that make a big difference. All right, people, I'm back home. Uh, I'm gonna relax the rest of the night. I mean, it was, it's, this is gonna be a super short video. Um, really didn't have anything else to do other than just help Chum out with getting his door and his fender on. Um, ended up putting fog lights also. So, yeah, I mean, if like always, if you like the video hit the like button um, 
comment down below subscribe if you're new hit the bell uh, also share the video with all your friends all your family whoever you want share the video and um, like I said here is the short footage of my nephew riding in uh, my hatch on a launch for the first time I mean he it explains itself you'll see what happened catch you guys in the next one peace I'm out okay run the seat Omar's car around the corner one time Yeah. <laughs> it's scary already! Oh, dude. No, this is too scary for me. This is too scary for me.